the week. I was having a good time. I was drinking every single day. I wasn't on mommy mode. As y'all know, I've been on mommy mode throughout this whole pandemic. I have my kid every single day. Um, uh, and even after like, and then like after my birthday week, I still have my kid and everything. And, you know, I was just living my best life on my birthday week. I know a lot of people was going to talk shit because, you know, the thing, obviously buying me a car and the shit that happened with the divorce that y'all don't even know why I even try to get a divorce, but whatever. But I was like, you know what? I'm just going to do what makes me happy because sometimes y'all forget what makes that things got to make me happy. Right. So, you know. Um, enjoying my life and everything, and I just see like a lot of fan pages with my pictures on it, or like with Barty or Cardi or whatever the fuck. You know, you could just tell then it's somebody fan page. Just keep bullying, like just keep bullying, keep picking, and just doing too much. So I just got really fucking upset, and I just went off. You know what I'm saying? Like I went completely off. Um. And it's just like I went off because it's like I be telling y'all sometimes to chill, but it just just like it just it just be too much. But then again, I have to understand that a lot of fan pages are new fan pages that they're not like fan pages that I go with way back. I know there's like I don't know, I think like a hundred, maybe thirty, forty, fifty, I don't know. There's a lot of fan fan pages on Instagram and on Twitter that I recognize seeing them throughout the years and everything and some of them I'm really close to like some of them that I usually would talk to on my Instagram message and everything DM whatever and um you know I got really fucking upset and I went off and it was like on every blog and shit. Other other people fans were like, oh, Cardi hate her fans and everything, which that's not even true. You know what I'm saying? I love my fan pages. I just like sometimes I be feeling like y'all have to separate certain things and y'all have to let me live my life. Like it's like I cannot live my life how other people think. I, uh, some some of y'all just, just want me to live my life without... Caring about my my life without caring about what makes me happy. Like, some of y'all be even suggesting for me to date fucking celebrities that have higher stats. And it's like, yo, I don't I don't live like that. I don't live or, or do things with people because of their status. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's like, I don't like that shit. Like, it's like, oh, oh, yeah, she should date this person. Oh, my gosh, everybody's going to be so happy. And it's like, yo... I don't do that, okay? I don't do that. Like, it's like I'm not that 22, 23-year-old girl that could be out here dating people. First of all, you got... People might not even love you for yourself. People are... People be trying to be with the Cardi B. And I also come with a package. You know what I'm saying? I come with a package. I have a child. So a lot of that shit, that meddling shit, the suggestion shit, I wasn't feeling... I wasn't feeling that every single time y'all keep fucking picking on me, bullying me. And it's, that shit was coming from a lot of my fan pages. So, you know, I said some shit like, oh, fuck y'all. I don't even need y'all. I don't even like y'all. Ah, y'all don't do nothing. And then I guess some fans, even if I wasn't talking to them, they still feel offended. Sometimes I just be, you know, like when I get mad, I just talk my shit. So it's like, uh, you know, I probably offend the fans that like uh, that I even have a relationship with, and I and they feel a certain type of way, like, oh, you offend the Barty gang and everything, and it's just like, no, I just don't like certain things. You know what I'm saying? I just don't like certain things, but it's like I feel like if I have a relationship with you, I don't even know why would you even feel that way, or you could just hit me up on my DM. But anyways, you know, a lot of my fans were begging me to address it on OnlyFans, and then two weeks later, I addressed it on my OnlyFans, and I did apologize. I apologize when it. This another thing about me. I apologize on my time. You know what I'm saying? Like I want. I'm not gonna come the next day and apologize for shit when I feel a certain type of way about something. Like it takes. I do it on my time. You know what I'm saying? I do it everything on my time. I don't, especially when it comes to people that I fuck with. Like, like when it comes to people that I fuck with, you got to let things breathe. Because I don't treat my fans as like a business. I don't treat my fans as like, oh, oh, they're my fans and everything. I feel like, yeah, for my family. And sometimes it takes time to make up with your family. Sometimes y'all need a little break. Like even when we're in relationships. Sometimes y'all just need a little break. 
and y'all could talk things out. And when I did talk things out, I did it on my OnlyFans because y'all wanted me to do it on my OnlyFans. And to people that was like, so people was like, no, because since you did it, since you insult us publicly and y'all still talking shit. So I'm like, you know what? Let me just get on my real life, which is now. And I'm going to just talk about it. You know what I'm saying? And to be honest with you, I'm glad that all that shit happened because I was really close to a lot of fan pages that I, I felt like, oh my gosh, like, you know, when you're so cool, cool with somebody on social media, I'm glad that it actually happened because a lot of y'all motherfuckers, y'all exposed your hand and I will never fuck with y'all again. Never fuck with y'all. Don't hate y'all. But it's like, y'all show me your hand and it's like, sometimes you got to have a fallout with people so they could really expose your hand and even in my real life in my personal life i have fired people or uh, certain friends i have cut off and it's like i fuck with people that it's like i haven't talked to in months and i never heard them talking shit about me I'm not kissing my ass you don't gotta kiss my ass i'm not a per i don't like one thing about me i don't like when people suck a fart out my ass that just shows me weakness you know what i'm saying i just like realness I like realness. My my team, my friends, they always keep it real with me. My family, they will keep it real with me. If I'm acting arrogant, my family will tell me. If I'm wearing something ugly, if they don't like a song, if they don't like a movement that I'm doing in my life, my family, my friends, my coworkers, everything, they will tell me. I'm not the type of person I need to try to suck a fart on my ass. And But a lot of y'all, while the bullshit happened, Y'all was exposing y'all hands on pages. A lot of y'all were on group chats talking high shit about me. And I found out about it. And it's just like, you know what? With all disrespect, suck my dick. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? With all disrespect. Yeah? You look so cute. Hi, mommy. Hi, baby. Hi, mommy. Hey. Hi. Hi, pretty girl. Hi, and, um... And I'm just glad that it kind of happened. Like I said, I do apologize to my fans that, like, you know, um, I spoke too fast because I was so angry at the moment that I spoke so fast. And it's like, yo, I I felt like, and then it's like a lot of y'all was telling me, like, oh, I felt offended. Even to some of them, I even had a conversation. It's like, but I wasn't talking about y'all, though. And you, sh- yeah? I can't mom. What? I took you. I took you. Look at that face. <laughs> um, and uh, what I was saying, oh girl, this girl, mommy, yeah, Look, mommy. I see you're high, you should get down from there. Get down, get down, get down. No, no, get down. Yeah, you need to get down before you fall. No, hey, <laughs> don't do that. <laughs> so, anyways, you know, mommy. yeah. Up. You don't even want to be up here. You just want. Yeah. But anyways, mommy, like I said, mommy. I discussed to. So I, I was talking to some of my fan pages, and I was like, you know, I wasn't talking about you. So why would you feel hurt? And they was explaining to me, like, you know, um, when you address us all. Yeah, you're not being specific. We all gonna feel hurt. And I was like, you know what? You're right. Like, it's like, I know I heard it a lot of fans because I didn't say some of y'all. I said, oh, and I wasn't even talking about all. So for that, like I said, I apologize. Um, like I said, sometimes when I get really upset, I talk right at the moment and everything. And, um, I never meant to like, like I said, y'all know I love y'all. Y'all know I fuck with y'all. Y'all know no. that me and y'all have like a certain type of relationship. But then again, like some of y'all, y'all really expose your hand. And then it's like, y'all want to be mad at me because I'm not fucking with y'all no more. But it's like some of the things that y'all have said, y'all really disrespecting me. And y'all keep disrespecting my team. And I don't like that. My first argument with a fan page was because y'all disrespecting my makeup artist. And it's like, yo, stop doing that because everybody around me. From makeup to hair to wardrobe to everybody, we all work so hard. And, like, lately I haven't even been on social media because I cannot let nothing distract me from what's going on right now. 2021, it's a it's going to be a very busy year. 
So right now I'm doing all the business moves right now, so everything could be great. I'm working on music, so that yeah. <laughs> ah. <laughs> No, it doesn't hurt. I'm just cutting my nails. So anyway, um, you know, like I'm saying, like I haven't really been on social yeah, media because I've been oh, trying no? to get my business together, <laughs> making sure that happen. everything goes right in Ow. 2021. I'm working on a lot of new music. And when I work on a lot of new music, my mind just rush. I want to make my visuals perfect. I want to make sure that everything is just perfect because I know when I do a good job, I know that's what makes y'all happy and um, good music. Good everything so it's just like i just been working so hard uh just because y'all don't see me it doesn't mean that i'm not working just because i'm not getting my makeup my hair done every day it doesn't mean that i'm working and like i'm also a mom too like it's like i can't even look i can't even go on live peace peacefully without my kid being around and everything so like i said um I'm sorry that if I if I offended some of my fan pages that I didn't mean that I wasn't talking to, but like it sounded like I was talking in general. Uh, I do have to realize that every single day these pages get bigger. Uh, these, this, uh, <laughs> the fandom gets bigger, so there's some. You know, like younger people or like some people that just like don't understand my lifestyle, that don't understand my heart, that don't know me from four or five years ago. So they might not understand how I am. So when I lashed out, it's just like I la it seemed like I lashed out everybody and it wasn't that. So um, I'll talk to you guys later because literally right now I'm working for tomorrow. Tomorrow's going to be a very long day. And yeah, talk to you guys later. Maybe tomorrow I'll go live and I'll show myself. Vamos. And bye-bye.